Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in for another video. And today, if you guys can notice in the background, the Jeep is wet because I just finished washing it. And today we're actually gonna do a review on this product from Jay Leon's Garage called Evaporate. One of the subscribers actually asked me the question, hey, could you go ahead and just give it a shot? So I went ahead and ordered it and now it's here guys. We're actually gonna give it a shot. And it does say, for the instructions, to go ahead and spray in the areas that you plan on using. So real quickly, we recommend using two towels during this drying process. Dunk one clean water, which is over there. And so it's damp, leave the other dry. And that one's drying right now. So this was a damp one, so that's pretty good. Uh, after you finish washing your vehicle and while it's still wet, spray evaporate onto the area that you like to dry. Then wipe and distribute every evenly on your damp towel. Buff to high gloss shine and remove any streaks with a second dry towel. Let's shake this up real quick to see how well it works. It would have helped if I would have had this open a little bit. And there it is. So let's go ahead, that should work now. All right, so we sprayed it right there. Now let's see how well it works. If you guys didn't know, when you guys wash your car, there's two times when your car gets scratched during the wash. It's the actual washing process and the drying process we're doing right now. So Evaporate is designed to lubricate the paint so your drying towel doesn't end up scratching your paint that's the purpose of this so oh, we got this side done i didn't spray that side should have let's go ahead and do the a little bit more of the hood all right it does feel like it's gliding a lot i'm not sure how much it's going to help for it to actually dry hey, you guys know something i could totally tell that it is helping dry it has like a like a little sheen to it Looks pretty nice. Usually when I'm drying with a, with a microfiber cloth, you still get a little bit of residue that's forming from the back and it looks like it's actually mostly gone. Honestly guys, I'm really liking this so far. I'm not sure you guys can see, but there's not much, much water staying behind after I spray that stuff. All right, so far so good. Let's go ahead and get this one out here. Almost dry. So let's see how that does. Oh yeah. It's looking really nice, guys. Honestly, it feels like it dried the car a whole lot faster. Normally, I'd be going back and forth, you know, from side panel to the other side panel and coming back to the hood, make sure I didn't leave any water spots. But, you know, it's looking really nice. The car has like this sheen to it. It seems polished without me actually polishing it. No watermarks at all. Look at this hood. This is what I'm really impressed with. And it feels really nice. I probably could use a clay bar to get some contaminants out of the paint and make it feel smoother. But man, guys, just by using this alone, the car came out really nice. And with that, guys, you know something? Now, since the whole car is completely done, I am going to re be recommending this because it worked really well. Let's get us a little bit. There you guys go. JLL's Garage Evaporate. It works well. Give it a shot.